Ladies and gentlemen, friends of the Baltic Sea region, I'm glad to be here. Thank you for the opportunity. Today, as we heard before from the previous panel, many economies, companies and industries around the world are in deep trouble. And the reasons behind are not only short-term problems. Success in the global economy requires not only new skills in production, products and services, but also the foresight to understand the market behavior. At the same time, energy and many raw materials become more expensive and the shortage of water and food is increased in many parts of the world. Green economy is understood as low carbon material and energy efficient economy, which maintains or even increases the natural capital and its benefits. By greening the economy, we seek economically, environmentally and socially sustainable growth and well-being that is sustainable development. At the heart of the green economy, however, are natural resources and ecosystems, their benefits and services for human well-being and existence. The future approach should be even more ambitious to create products and solutions that make money and not only avoid harming the environment and society, but have a positive impact on both. New technologies will, will not, however, do the job for us if we don't create opportunities for a fundamental shift in a production and consumption. To make it happen, the green economy requires three core elements. This may sound cliche, but it's true. Smart consumers, smarter businesses and governments with real foresight. We need to focus on the economy by creating prosperity without increasing the pressure on resource use and envi environmental impacts. In other words, we need to become more resource efficient. For example, our common interest is to protect the Baltic Sea and restore the sea's good ecologi ecological status by 2025, 21. We all aim at promoting sustainable use and management of natural resources, water, soil, forests and fish stocks. Besides fishery, fishing is also a recreational activity valued by many citizens around the Baltic Sea. Ecotourism offers unique experiences as well as user-friendly service con concepts. To maintain the recreational value of our environment, we need to manage the resources properly, properly and protect the sea. The better we take care and manage the natural resources and ecosystems, the longer they will be sustained. For the Baltic Sea, one of the major so sources of nutrient input in the coastal states is agriculture, as, we, as was mentioned before. We need to implement cost-efficient and sustainable so solutions and measures to decrease the agricultural runoff. One of the strengths of our region overall is the innovative capacity. Our region ranks high in international comparisons related to our education systems which provide for top-level researchers also in the future. In many parts of our region, resources have been allocated for research, development and innovation purposes already long before such goals were set in the EU 2020 strategy. Using this innovative capacity to tackle the challenges of sustainable development of our region will at the same time strengthen our competitive position in international markets. Both the private and public sectors increasingly recognize that future will depend on leadership in resource-related and climate-friendly innovation. The green economy offers new possibilities for recycling, bioeconomy and clean tech. It contributes even to new kind of health and wellness services. 
innovation in key areas such as information technology and advanced materials has opened up avenues that were previously out of sight. Of course, cleaning the sea is not always in painless process, as has for example become evident when the Baltic Sea countries prepare themselves to lower sulfur emission, emissions from ships and route trafficking in the sea. It will inevitably increase temporarily the transport costs in our region, but this is the price we finally have to pay to ensure sustainability of the marine traffic in our waters. We should not forget that fulfilling the sulfur re reduction requirement will create new businesses opportunities, new business opportunities for our companies, not just additional costs. Requirements push technology development. By being in the vanguard in applying cleaner technologies, we will not only be in a stronger competitive position when sailing in other parts of the world, but we will also be able to market our technologies and know how a similar requirements will eventually have to be adopted elsewhere as well. Public sector should actually walk the talk. Besides creating enable environments, the government and public sector should self-evidently act as a role model. The public sector should also lead on green procurement to build markets that take innovations beyond pilot scale. Greening the economy consists, for example, of comprehensive introduction of smart and sustainable solutions and changes in the structures of society, economy, economic incentives and taxes, and sustainable public procurement. Companies, Carmen, if you could summarize yes, it shortly. I'm coming please. to end. Thank Companies you. have a key role in growth, but realizing green growth also requires changes in consumption. And no country makes it alone. The strength of our region is cooperation. The countries around the Baltic Sea have cooperated long before the Baltic Sea strategy was adopted. <laughs> the environment ministers approved the revised Baltic Sea action plan by the Helsinki Commission in October this year. This sets ambitious targets for each country to decrease nitrogen and prosperous disasters in the sea. The uh, Northern Dimension Environmental Partnership and its support fund promote cross-border environmental protection and speed up the implementation of the Baltic Sea Action Plan. The fund brings together the financing institution, donor community, the European Commission, Russia, Belarus, and ultimately the private sector. It thereby gives business opportunities and facilitates taking into oper operation of best available technology. Thank you.